Morning everyone, time's a little bit tight today, so uh, I'm taking you on my walk to work while we make the video. So, how's that? First on today's video, uh, the new version of iOS Beta. This is the 15.4 Beta, has come out. It has uh, got a new feature in there, which basically means you can wear a mask and unlock your phone using Face ID, but you don't need the Apple Watch anymore. That's a pretty good thing. It basically means that it uses just the space around your eyes as a way of um, identifying you. So it is less secure than regular Face ID, but regular Face ID is like one in a million wrong. And uh, thank you very much. Coffee just arrived with Smarties. Amazing. Um, regular Face ID is like one in a million uh, incorrect unlocks and uh, Touch ID is like one in 50,000. So I'm guessing it's still gonna be a lot better. Probably one in 100,000. 250,000 something like that we haven't got details on that but Apple will release that at some point soon so that's pretty cool if you don't use an Apple watch you will be able to now unlock your phone using face ID even when you've got a mask on you will be less secure but it will work now as you guys know I'm a massive fan of coffee this is actually one of the better coffees that I've had this is all bar one in Birmingham um, so I'm gonna have this and then we'll move on to the next space for the next story same uh, iOS beta also includes 37 new emojis which I know is the exact reason that you're all going to download it straight away. We all love some new emojis. That's the Apple Store. Also on the next version of Mac OS beta as well which has just come out again yesterday at the point of recording this but today when I found out obviously um, universal control is finally happening, so I will get that beta as soon as possible, we'll get it tried, but from what I'm hearing so far, it's basically as quick as a wide connection. It doesn't seem like there's any latency at all, which is awesome. But why has it taken until now? And although we've got universal control that's finally come to the mark, these iMacs with Intel, with the nano texture display, all of a sudden you can't get one until the end of March. Seems to fit in quite nicely with a spring event. And yes, I did ask the guys here, they said it was okay to build. This is now the only product with a glowing Apple logo. And one final story before we wrap this up for today. I don't know it's a weird one, we haven't done iCove answers, but I might pop one of those together for the weekend as a little bonus for you. I've also got some stuff to unbox this weekend because we've got a robot vacuum cleaner arrived. That was quite cool. But yes, the last story is that AirPods, which you're listening to me on now, they sound pretty good. Apart from that background noise, AirPods look like uh, there is a patent that might be adding some sort of biometrics to your AirPods. So they wouldn't actually work without you authenticating them. Now, I don't know if that's gonna be touch ID on the outside or if it's actually gonna identify the shape of your ear because they're all pretty unique, but it's an interesting concept. And this city, by the way, is undergoing a lot of construction work at the minute. And that is because we've got the Commonwealth Games coming here this summer. So that's going to be quite impressive. The, uh, the whole of that fountain, sort of water piece in front of the City Hall. That's all being renovated, the City Hall itself. Loads of stuff going on. We just had trams installed. There's the tram lines. I'm not running at the minute, but they'll be back soon. And that's it, I've got to work. That's, that's where I work, where all the building stuff's going on. That's gonna be my cafe, pretty cool. Um, Thank you for joining me on this little trip around our city. I just want to point out that this video wouldn't have been possible without the Joby Gorilla Pod MagSafe Edition, which uh, they sent me far too long ago. And I used actually when we were um, revamping the office space, the, the iCave, um, 
but then never made a video on for them and i'm really sorry to joby but it is really helpful it's really cool if you want to try it out at some point in the future i'll leave a link down in the description but this is kind of where we leave it uh, if you want the latest apple news leaks rumors all that good stuff every weekday at 1300 utc like the video subscribe to the channel ring the bell join the patreons thanks for joining